Well, Jeannie Buss was here with the Board of Governors uh, last week and stayed through the weekend uh, and tried to encourage me to coach the team. And if there's anyone that can encourage me to do anything, it's Jeannie Buss. But I was able to withstand her arguments the whole time. <laughs> Phil, in terms of Carmelo Anthony, you've said you'd like to have Carmelo Anthony back. Where are you in terms of wooing Carmelo or trying to work something out with him for the future? Wooing seems to fit with Jeannie Buss, not with Carmelo Anthony. That's, uh, you know, I like to convince him. I like to appeal to his better nature of uh, winning, and I think that's what we want to do. Well, I don't know if you saw the report this morning about you and Jim Dolan, I guess, running heads a little bit. I guess, could you talk about that? And, and how important is it to you to have guys in place, top to bottom, that are your guys be comfortable with, uh, to, to kind of create your own regime? Oh, I like to know that uh, the people that are here want to buy in and they want to be part of it and they want to throw their entire being into what we're trying to do. And that's important without a doubt. That they have a brand or stamp on them that uh, puts them as Phil Jackson's guy or whatever, it's not important. Um, you know, it's important that we join forces and we join minds together and work together. That's that's a big thing. As far as Jim Dolan's promise or his premise when I took this job that he was going to leave basketball decisions up to me, um, I really, he's been loyal to that promise and, uh, you know, going forward from last week through this week is uh, just wanted to talk to Mike when we were through talking to him on the staff, it was all our decision. Um, he's been very, uh, very true to his word up, up to this point.